what you know about me. What are some red flags that we can give to other professionals out now that are looking for jobs? What are some red flags that they may catch on an interview that you hear often that they should look out for? If you try to negotiate salary and they get pissed at you for negotiating salary, especially if it's like mm -hmm. the first uh, first counter offer, red flag. Um, if they tell you that this is a politics free environment, <laughs> red fucking flag, scarlet flag. Um, if they say, yo, we're a family, red flag. <laughs> Stars and stripe, red flag, red flag. Like it's, 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 it's red flag. Um, if they say shit like, um, if they say shit like, yo, we're a hybrid environment, but you got to be at the office more than three days a week. Red flag. Red flag. Um, <laughs> it's so bad. I'm to, you named all the major ones I would think of for sure. The family yeah. one for sure. Can't stand the family one. The hybrid, obviously. Uh, I hate when we have a great diverse culture. I hate when they say that. It's like, what, what does that actually mean? Can I come in there and be myself and all that? We know I can't. Um, what other? It's so many, man. It's so it's so many red flags. I also look, I also tell people to look at leadership. Yeah. Look, look at leadership and, and really try to get some face time with leadership. The CEO, I will look at what they're doing, go Googling them, see if there's any bad press on them, see how they're conveying their message out to the public, go on LinkedIn and all those things, right? Because that's the main thing for me. I want to know who I'm working with. I want to know who I'm dealing with, like you said earlier. I want to know if you're aligned with my missions and things of that nature, right? And then just like for CEOs right now, it's, I got to trust you, man. Yeah. I, I, I got to really trust you with my no, because it, it, this is an opportunity for a lot of people. This is a renaissance. I'm going to tell the audience, right? It's like you have a chance right now to be a consultant. Right now, consulting work is at an all time high. And there's mm -hmm. going to be so many solopreneurs being started and created out of this. There's going to be so many people that have to start this. And you're going to see a shift in the agency world. You're going to see a shift in consultancy. You're going to see a shift in a lot of different fabrics of business. Right. And this is an opportunity for you to either one play the game and continue that or create a sustainable lifestyle for your family and your future. Is it going to be hard? Hell yeah. I'm telling you right now, y'all, it's hard as hell. But develop your relationships. If you develop your relationships and really just, you know, like I said, know your worth, know your strengths and play into that, you're going to be solid.